And speaking of uh, floors and whatnot, the TCU Horned Frogs. There's another team that I can't see a floor that's that's way down there for them. Six and four last year, five and seven the year before that. I don't think Gary Patterson is going to let that happen again. Um, the FPI has got them going seven and five. SP Plus got them going seven and five. The win total is seven and a half. To go over is minus one twenty five. To go under is minus one oh five. So the sports books like the juice here. Like they like them going over. Um, you know, since twenty seventeen, TCU's kind of been propped up by their defense, uh, but they've always been dragged down by their offense. I think that could change this year. Like quarterback Max Duggan is back. Uh hopefully won't have to deal with any of the medical issues he did last year, et cetera. Sure. Running back Zach Evans, wide receiver uh Quentin Johnson. Like, they showed flashes of brilliance last year. They are absurd playmakers. They got six offensive linemen back and a ton of skill talent returns. I think the offense, like this, on paper, it is the best that they've ever had on Gary Patterson. Yep. And I, I think it's going to show in a big way this year. Patterson's four two five defense uh, finished number two in success rate in 2020 in the country. That's 33%. Like, that's how many, uh, or that's the plays that they allowed to be successful last year. Um, they, they should be, you know, fantastic again. They got a pair of uh, FBS's best defensive ends and cornerbacks. They got studs everywhere. Like, it, they, the road schedule is going to be tough, but, like, the whole schedule is full of winnable games outside of maybe Oklahoma. I was just about to say, there's only one one piece of yeah. red in this whole thing. Like, uh, even even at Iowa State, like, I could see a world where they can beat Iowa State. Like, I'm I'm for sure going over the seven half here. Yes. Like Same, I, everything I said about Oklahoma State, I like this team a little bit just better. Just repeat. Right? A little bit better. I mean, it's minus one twenty five to go over. I don't even care about the juice. Like this is this is gonna be a good team. Yeah. Like this is one to look out for. So, because I I do trust Max Duggan a little bit. I think he's gonna be fantastic, man. I think he's gonna be fantastic. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter at Gary WCE at Chris B. Giannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.